Hi guys, today I'll be showing you how to create your own Yayoi Summer installation. For this project, you'll need coloured paper, scissors and a glue stick, and some oil pastels. For the first step, you'll need to create some interesting shapes for your installation. I've chosen to replicate Yayoko Summer's pumpkins using blue paper to contrast the yellow background, but you can use any colour as long as they contrast each other. To create the depth of field, I'm cutting pumpkins out in various sizes. Once you've cut your shapes out, the next step is to focus on composition. To make it look like we're in a room, I'm placing larger pumpkins along the bottom of the page to make them appear closer to us. The placement of the smaller pumpkins will be placed much higher on the page to enhance the depth of field. Once you've decided on the composition, fix the objects onto the background using glue stick. Now it's time to add polka dots in the style of Yakusama. For the polka dots, I'll be using a yellow oil pastel so that it will stand out on the blue pumpkin. This is another piece I created in response to Yayoko Summer. You can see how the dots are used to contour the pumpkin in this piece. I'm adding the polka dots to enhance the shape of the pumpkins by starting with smaller dots on the top of the shape. And as I work my way down, following the curved edges, the dots are larger in the middle, then the dots become smaller near to the bottom. Establish the overall shape of the pumpkin with these dots, so now I will begin to fill in the gaps of smaller dots for texture. As I'm filling each shape with polka dots, I'm also using a darker oil pastel to add the stalks of the pumpkin. The final step in creating your installation is to define the room with polka dots. Here is another installation that I've created in response to Yayoko Sama. You can see how the dots have been used in this piece to indicate the sides of the room. You can change the shape of the dots to show the sides of the wall, ceiling and flooring. As the perspective of my room is a top-down view, I'm filling the room with elongated dots to indicate the flooring. Once you've completed this step, you should have your very own Yayoko Sama installation. To enhance the scale of your room, you can also create your very own Yayoko Sama so she can visit your installation. As Yayoko Sama's iconic hair and outfit is mainly red, I've drawn her silhouette on a red paper to cut out. For her hands and face, I'm cutting them out from a white piece of paper and then gluing them down onto the red base. black pen for her sunglasses and a red pen for her lips. A pink oil pastel can also be used for her blush. For the final step, I'm using a white oil pastel to add the various sizes of polka dots on the dress. And you can also use a black oil pastel for her feet. And there you have it, your very own Yayoko Summer, ready to visit your installation. <laughs> Enjoyed doing this project and thank you for watching. Until next time, bye!